So in back of me, of course, is the Washington Monument. Did you know that from 1884 to 1889, it was the tallest structure in the entire world until the Eiffel Tower was completed? The Washington Monument, designed by Robert Mills and eventually completed by Thomas Casey and the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers, honors and memorializes General and later First President of the United States, George Washington. The structure was completed in two phases of construction, one private from 1848 to 1854 and one public from 1876 to 1884. It officially opened on October 9, 1888. The monument, made of marble, granite, and bluestone gneiss, is both the world's tallest predominantly stone structure and the world's tallest obelisk at 554 feet 7 inches or 169 meters tall. It's a hollow Egyptian style stone obelisk with a 500 foot tall column topped by a 55 foot tall pyramidion. Its walls are 15 feet thick at its base and one and a half feet thick at their top. Construction of the monument began in 1848 and was halted from 1854 to 1876 due to a lack of funds, a struggle for control over the Washington National Monument Society, and the American Civil War. Although the stone structure was completed in 1884, Internal ironwork, the knoll, and installation of memorial stones were not completed until 1888. You can see the difference in shading of the marble at the 150 foot or 46 meter mark, which shows where construction was halted and later resumed with marble from a different source. The interior is occupied by 897 iron stairs that spiral up the walls with an elevator in the center. The stairs contain 50 sections. The pyramidion is eight observation windows, two per side, and eight red aircraft warning lights to per side. Two aluminum lightning rods protect the monument. The monument has had a history of restoration and repairs. In the early 1900s, material started oozing out between the outer stones of the first construction period below the 150 foot mark and was referred to by tourists as geological tuberculosis. The monument underwent an extensive restoration project between 1998 and 2001, which included cleaning and repairing the monument's exterior and interior stonework. New exhibits celebrating the life of George Washington and the monument's place in history were also added. On September 7, 2004, the monument closed for a $15 million renovation, which included numerous security upgrades and redesign of the monument grounds. The monument reopened April 1, 2005. On August 23, 2011, the Washington Monument sustained damage during the 5.8 magnitude Virginia earthquake. Over 150 cracks were found in the monument and it was closed for repairs until 2014. Repairs to the monument cost $15 million. It was closed again for elevator system repairs, security upgrades, and mitigation of soil contamination from August 2016 through September 2019. The soil contamination first started in the 1880s. In 2020 and 2021, the Washington Monument was temporarily closed due to COVID-19. Please check the National Park Service website to see the monument's current status.